Good morning! Where are we going, Libby? We're going to Arizona! Yep, you heard it correctly. We're headed to Arizona this morning. Yes. We're going to get on the bus, and then we're gonna get on the flight, and then we're gonna- we're gonna get off the flight. And we're gonna get on, on the flight. The flight. <laughs> then we're gonna get off the flight. And then we're gonna get on a bus, and then, and then we're we'll gonna get there. there. <laughs> So, I guess I'll see you in Arizona. Yeah. What? Boy, everybody told me you could be whatever you wanna be. So I told myself, I'ma be a singer, I'ma play on the keys. I can do whatever I want if I just believe. Yeah, but then over the years, everybody's telling me to find a career. Huh. And I'll be rolling my eyes, thinking I'll be alright with my guitar by my side. But now it's like 55 quid for my phone bill and a tether for my bus pass too. I wish I could go back and tell myself that. Life is gonna hit you hard. They say money won't. Guys, we made it to Arizona! Yes! Uh, here's a little room. Super cool. We got a little living room area. What? Then we move right into the bathroom. Come on, come on. Okay. She's a lining. Period. And then we move into like a little room. Yay! Oh, also. We have a balcony, which is like, so sick. Look at this. There's a screen. <laughs> you wanna see my view? I know you do. Look at that. Ain't she pretty? But seriously, on a real note? What? So I'm gonna change, and then we're probably gonna go to dinner. Don't know where yet, but yeah, we're in Arizona. I'm so excited. We just had our first in and out experience. I've done this a lot. Very good. It was very good. I very much liked the, it a lot. The specialty sauce on the cheeseburger. A1. I love in and out My Same. only problem, they did not put my ketchup and mustard on my hamburger. Oh yeah, I had to put it on mine. It made me sad. I ate it dry. <laughs> good morning. Um, Just got my Starbucks. It's game day. Oh, just got some on my face. That's okay. Um, Pro tip order Starbucks the night before so it gets here in the morning and you have a reason to really wake up. Um, yeah. Maybe let's, I wanna kinda show you like the little areas cause I haven't really seen any. <laughs> Look how cute this is. <gasps> Aww. And then, wait, wait, wait. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Good morning, Arizona. Yeah, let's get into it. Let's have a great day. Probably gonna meet some of the friends down at Brecky. Get into it. Cab. And then go have a great day. I'll see you. Breaking news. Caroline does not need glasses. <laughs> we all have been shocked this morning. Apparently I'm a pathological liar. I didn't know that. That was never the plan. That was not my intention. To manipulate the entire company. No! <laughs> I just... I don't know. <laughs> what do you want me to say? Do you want me to explain myself? No. <laughs> I just want everyone to be really proud of me in my suitcase. <laughs> Mini Mike. On today's portion of Mini Mike, we will be asking a pregame question. Today's pregame question is, I'm going to steal yours. Yeah. If you had a parrot, what would you teach your parrot to say? I would teach my parrot the rap god rap. I think that's it. That's... Yeah. I would teach it to say, you were the girl, the love. <laughs> Every time someone walked into the room. Good answer. Um, I would teach it curse words and how to laugh at all my jokes. 
And I would teach the parrot to always agree with me, so then that way I just feel reassured on what I'm thinking. Um, also, shout out to Chris Saji in the back right now. Look at those sunnies. <laughs> Look at him go. He's doing great. Yeah, love it. Man of the people. Yep. I would train my parrot to say swaggy and a story. Um, if I could train my pet parrot to say anything, I would have it say, Jesus loves you and go party animals. So I would train it to say, I love you, just to, for someone to tell me I love you every single day. And I would also train it to say, you're beautiful, to remind myself every day that I am beautiful. <laughs> Look at the field. What? Hey guys. So we're in the middle of the game right now. Um, I've got a really good game day stuff. Not to say they're the best. But right now, they're the best. I don't know what I would do without them. We're just mid game, vibe and dog. That's all I can say. That's all I could ask for. You know, we stay stacked, we stay staffed, we stay lit, we stay, we stay vigilant. That's what we stay. We stay lit and stay vigilant. This is where our stand is. Wow. Great day. Oh my goodness. Princess Potassium. What's up, what's up? Ah! It's the best day ever. <laughs> oh, young professor too. This is just a whirlwind of a day. <laughs> so the best day ever. It's pretty good. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah. Did you have a good day? I had a great I'm day. Good. I don't know who you're doing. Just vibing. Oh my gosh, it's Francis! <laughs> Hi. Hi. We're just vlogging. We're out here. You know. How's it hang? Hey, how are ya? What's up? So basically, I'm gonna go see if anybody else needs help because I'm a good friend. Hey! Hey, Reese! What's up? Hey! Go, 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 go! Woo! Not sure. Blue's at her. So I'm gonna go check if they need help and see what I can do. See what I can make better. This is we're about making people better. Anthony, yeah! What's up, how was your day? First game? So luck. We like this, you're doing the formation. I went down on the wrong knee. That's okay, um, I it, he did not fall. <laughs> I was like this. Literally, yeah. literally, literally, he was like, he was like this, and he was like, all right, all right. Some wrong leg, wrong, wrong leg. leg. Literally, I was like, get up there, bro. Just stand up there. All in all, great day one, great game day staff, great energy. Can't wait to do it all tomorrow. Okay, I'll I, I love my job. <laughs> Yay. Uh, bananas won tonight, so. Turn up. Okay, post game interview question. Um, how many people do you think you took to the bathroom tonight? Uh, plus or minus 400. Good. That's a good number. Yeah. Libby. Libby. <laughs> you only get one. Party. Okay. Party. All right, Libby. Yeah. Post game interview question. What is it? How many people do you think bought foam fingers today? Mm, Five thousand. Whoa. I think you only got a box of one forty four. <laughs> Lies. Sorry. Good morning. It's day two. Of our Arizona trip. Oh, it's quite nipply out this morning. I got my Starbucks. 
Super pumped about that. Gonna go down and eat some breakfast. Cause I didn't order a muffin. Cause I think they were out of them. But let me click on it. Anyways. Let's get into it. Have a great day. A lovely little breakfast. It was so delish. Had to stop by the golf pro shop. Got a little ball marker. It says Lookout Mountain, Phoenix, Arizona. It's got a little owl on it. I don't know if you can see that. But I got two. I got one for me and one for Shane, our warehouse manager guy, because we golf. So I thought that was super cool. I had to share. But I'm going to head to the gift shop, get an energy drink, and we're going to get on the bus. We're going to have a great day. We're going to just keep saying that, but it's so true. But backpack is packed, double checked, and we're ready to go. We're just ready to go. The sun is beaming. The air is cold, but it's going to get warm. I'm going to think of a pregame question of the day. We're at the stadium for day two. Pumped, ready, go, go animals. Go yeah. animals. Um, lost soldier. JD. Okay, good. It's Friday. It's, it's pretty happening. exciting. Here's Kate. She's got an exciting thing for us in our stance. We're gonna have. Airplugs! So if anyone comes up to your stand asking for airplugs, you will have some. Hey, Mike. Okay, so we got the pregame question of the day, and the pregame question of the day is, Jamal, do you have any game superstitions? If so, what are they? Always go for a run, 50 miles at least. Um, that that'll guarantee a good day. Good day. If Jared is not in his banana pants by 3 p.m., it's not going to be good. I have to have a Celsius at 3.30 when my stand opens up. And then I also have to have a Celsius at 8.30 mid-game type of deal to finish out the night. Keep that energy up and going. So, you guys want to say hi? Hi. Yeah. Yeah. POV pushing the case. <laughs> Up the hill. I saw this cart behind me. <laughs> this is the hard part, ladies and gents, actually. <sighs> the calves are burning. Almost there. Almost at the curb. Holy crap. <sighs> I believe that I'm like physically fit sometimes. But these hills prove to be, to prove to me that I'm not physically fit whatsoever. You go to the gym. No. You work out. But you know, that doesn't really matter. You give a case, throw some tables on it, some soda, wire baskets. Um, more wired baskets, give you a full bladder, you give a, you give a girl a hill, you know what she's got to get? A calf workout, a calf workout is what she's going to get, and out of breath, she's going to get a calf workout and be out of breath. That's, <laughs> that concludes the case POV push of Peoria, Arizona. I'm tired, but we got one more. I just didn't know it's the case. So, look at that. We are changed, ready to rock and roll. Excited to meet my game day stuff today. It's gonna be a great day, really is. We keep saying it's gonna be, so let's go. Look at this. <sighs> My man Anna's got me this new awesome yellow panty bag. It's the sweetest early birthday present ever. 
I may have teared up a little bit. I definitely did. Just already best day ever. So excited. Let's keep it going. Keep it rolling. Almost game time. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, just doing my pregame ritual to my pregame question of the day. What is my superstition? It's the Celsius at 3:30. Some of my game day stuff. Just also drink Celsius. It's just crazy. What flavor do you have? Dude? I have tropical vibe. No way. Yeah. Is, that, is it a good flavor? I How mean, do we feel about I, it? I haven't tried it yet, but it's it's always gonna be good with Celsius. Do you want to do a taste test? Let's see. Let's do it. Strike it. Wow. Listen to that sound. Oh. Wow. Ready? Cheers. Thoughts? Perfect. That's right. Cheers. 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 Yeah, really? Really? Oh yeah. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to the field. We're out here in the middle of nowhere, Arizona. Uh, we haven't seen a lick of green except for right here by the field. We love it out here. I feel like we're in 1984. So uniform. Uh, big shout out to McDonald's and In and Out, uh, making me sick all weekend. Uh, Go follow me on socials at Maceo dancing <laughs> dance, <laughs> at dancing up on TikTok. <laughs> go dogs and go bananas. <laughs> but at the end of the day, great night one. <laughs> at the end of the day, great night two. Wow, great night one. Great one night one, great night two. Honestly, it was a package deal. Nice package deal. <laughs> two and one. Two for one. So buy one get two free see you night three good morning happy day three a little fun little thing that i did this morning was i thought i didn't get my starbucks delivery so i ordered another one turns out it was just at the front desk that was on me though so yeah but in my defense the first Uber Eats delivery gal um, didn't call. And then there was no messages either. So I didn't know that it was at the front desk. But I ordered another one without looking first. And that's on me. Turns out it was at the front desk. So I ordered another one. But we're good. Yeah, you can go We've got it. Yeah. Now we're headed to breakfast. Hey, guys. Hey. Hey. There's waffles. There's waffles. So Shut the front door. All right. Breakfast sounds good. Here we go. Pretty game question of the day for day three is: What is your go-to energy drink to start the day off? I'm talking brand. I'm talking flavor. I'm talking the whole night. We want the full rundown. I'm going to get it. We're all going to get it. Let's go. Day three. Pre-game. Question of the day. What? Hey, guys. My go-to energy drink um, is Celsius, specifically Fantasy Vibe. Um, going to need a couple of those throughout the day to survive the day today. Okay. I would have to say my go-to energy drink would be... Um, a Celsius Oasis vibe and depends on my mood for the day probably one because they're not good for your heart but probably two by the end of the day and that's it so I would typically say a water but in reality it's a Celsius um, I'm with I'm with uh, Kaylin maybe Oasis vibe tropical vibe is really good love a good orange Celsius or a Starbucks depends on the day but game days Celsius for sure Alani knew and Alani knew of any flavor. I would have to go with the brown sugar chicken espresso from Starbucks. <laughs> Do you have an answer? Oasis vibe Good. as well. And um, Galaxy Celsius. She said sorry. I didn't. <laughs> no, that's good. She was ready.
Nice. How did we feel? Great. Good. Green is great. Thank you.